Hello everybody, it's Assembly uh, Member Clyde Vanell. Just um, getting to everyone after the election. Um, thank you for all your support. Uh, thank you for, uh, for all the votes um, and thank you for the contributions. But today I want to speak about fireworks. Fireworks um, that's been going on in, in our community at night. A lot of people have been uh, complaining about that. A lot of people have been losing sleep. Uh, fireworks uh, have been happening uh, across the country. Uh, across the country, people have been complaining about uh, fireworks going on through all times at night. As a matter of fact, and uh, people have been contacting my office. Um, but on Monday, a group of, 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 of lawmakers uh, got together and went down to City Hall to honk their horns by the mayor's, uh, uh, by, Gracie, uh, by Gracie Mansion to complain about the noise of the fireworks. And while we were out um, campaigning, the number one thing that people were complaining about was fireworks at night. Um, and, you know, put, uh, put a post and let me know what you think about that. Um, uh, so people were complaining about fireworks, and these fireworks are happening from nighttime, from nine, from nine p.m., and it goes through, I mean, through hours of the night. Now I thought originally it was for Juneteenth, and I thought that's what was going on, but these fireworks has continued. Now I walk in the morning, I jog in the morning, and I see boxes of the fireworks on the ground. I see evidence of all these fireworks on the ground. So I wanted to figure out one thing. Is that first of all is that happening in your neighborhood? Is that happening to you? Are you hearing fireworks at night? You know, put that in the comments. Let me know what, what's going on. Is that is, is that happening? But I want to talk about another aspect of it. Right? Some people said that uh, the fireworks were a result is a result of uh, and it's a you know some people have a conspiracy theory that the fireworks is being done and funded by um, the um, the government because of the protests. No, that's not true. That's not going on. Noel, Noel said that's happening. Yeah, we're, we're, you know we they, we're all having it. Yep, that's right. So people saying that it's happening um, because of, of a, a conspiracy. That's not happening, right? People are buying. You know, people in in these neighborhoods are buying these these um these fireworks then i went to do some research and i looked at what's going on with where they're getting the fireworks and how it's getting uh you know how how it's getting into the community and how much it costs keep in mind these fireworks cost a lot of money for people to go and and and, and light up these fireworks these are not small firecrackers these are on some on some parts professional grade fireworks. A box of some of these fireworks can be 50 to, to hundreds of dollars. Think about it. If they are lighting up these fireworks for hours, it's a lot of money that's going on. So when we look at these fireworks, what's, what's going on? I see, I, see, uh, I, I see my public advocate here. We're dealing with these fireworks. But I want to talk to young people about these kinds of fireworks. Right now, it's difficult to get a job. Right now, many people, even the city, is talking about laying off 22,000 people. Why would young people spend the money on fireworks? Why would you spend thousands of dollars, because sometimes it's thousands of dollars that you hear of these fireworks, to watch that money blow up in the air? I'm trying to figure out what is the attraction of doing that. And when we talk about business and investment, why are young people investing even $50, $100, $200, $1,000 of dollars to light it up and burn it up? I wonder if you can give me $20 and I take the $20 and I light it on fire and I make noise. Is that not the same thing? 
I'm trying to figure out what is the what is the sense of watching your money light up and burn. I was speaking to my to, to my staff about this, and one of my staff members said that someone told her that they took their I, I can't even say it. I, I'll, I'll talk about it. Someone actually took their stimulus check and spent their stimulus check on fireworks. How, how can we do that? How does that make sense? How does, how does that make sense? You must not care. Now, I can imagine this. Imagine someone says that I want to spend my money to make people happy so I do fireworks for the community so that people could enjoy it. That's an altruistic reason to be able to have fireworks so people could enjoy it. But what happens when it's being done every night? I can understand on June, July 4th. I can understand on Juneteenth. But last night was Wednesday night and I heard fireworks going on. And so it's not for the enjoyment of the community. What is going on? Please explain to me the economic. I think I'm a business person. I'm a, you know, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a public official, and I try to make sure that, for example, if you look right underneath uh, this posting, there's going to be a list of jobs. So we have a, we, we have over 200 jobs, a list of over 200 jobs that are hiring. I want to make sure that people are working and have opportunities for jobs. But I would really like to understand the economics of young people or people with these fireworks. Keep in mind, here's another thing that's happening. People are going to Pennsylvania or going to other states, buying these fireworks, coming back, and then selling them in the community for triple the price or double the price. That person doing that, first of all, the, the mayor said that they created a task force to, to, to address that. But I can't understand me in my mind to be able to go and spend that kind of money for a box of things that I'm going to burn and blow up. We have too much excess. Again, we may not be, we may not be, uh, people are crying and, and saying how we are uh, in a position where people don't have money. But I can't be in a position where I'm giving away food, I'm giving away um, PPE, I'm giving away uh, masks, and then people are taking money and buying fireworks. That, that doesn't make sense. It, it doesn't make sense. Who's doing that? Well, let's talk about another thing. People heard about the culture of not snitching, and they're saying, oh my God, the, 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 uh, the young people or the, the people over there don't snitch. What about you? Somebody on your block is doing fireworks. You know the house. You know the people. Are you reporting that person that's doing the fireworks? Are we, are we doing that? We can't let, we can't give cover to the people on the block doing the fireworks. Now, if they want to do it, July 4th is, today is Thursday. July 4th is next Saturday. Is it going to happen like crazy until next Saturday? And then, after Saturday, is he going to continue? I, I, I just need to understand that. I just need to understand this. Because it doesn't, make, it doesn't make any sense. We have to make sure that, you know, we talk to the people on the block that are doing it. Or the people that you know that are doing it. Or the people's children that are doing the fireworks. We have to make sure that we do that. Yes, Noel said, Noel said that... July 4th is canceled. July 4th actually is not canceled. New York City is going to have multiple uh, fireworks displays. They're not, going to, they're not going to let us know exactly where it's going to be because they don't want people to gather. But New York City is going to have a number of smaller uh, fireworks displays. But I'm just trying to figure out why it makes sense for you, whoever it is, to be able to buy fireworks and set them off. Why are you lighting your money on fire? Am I am I out of touch? Am I just too old and am, am I out of touch? 
But I want to know why are people lighting up their money and turning it on fire? Please let me know. Respond in the comments. You know, let me know what's going on because I need to understand this phenomenon.